dedication More than a man is an endless job Good for humanity, y'all deserve some props Everybody knows the sound is clear Everybody knows they hear the truth Everybody knows the sound is clear Everybody knows they hear the truth More than a man, add some civility More than a man, build your integrity More than a man, brings dependability to family And his words, his bonds will stand with Hello mothers and fathers out there I want to try to talk to you for a second About helping you with your son And creating a great man in this world for him to do good things. I wrote four books that I believe will help him find his way through the world, navigating and becoming a great man. And they're very uh, short books and not, you know, long or overbearing. You know, it's common sense information, uh, plain talk that everyone can understand. And if you buy a form, I think he'll learn to respect that decision um, that, you know, you gave him something to read most kids don't want to read, but you gave him something to read, and this is going to be a very defining moment in his life, because you want to help him become a great man. So mothers and fathers, don't be afraid. Buy the books and give them to your, your son, the young man in your life, that you want to help become a great man. It's well worth it, I believe. Four books every young man should have. The first book is Molding a Man. And it goes from adolescence to college, talking about all the things a young man should be doing in order to become a great man. The second book, 10 Steps for a Young Man to Become a Great Man, goes through all the things a young man should know about that will help him become a great man. Third book, Code of a Man, which lets a young man know being a man is all about. And the fourth book, Molding, making a woman, lets a young man know what he needs to look for in a woman to make her worthy of being a wife. Let's be real, guys. We all want to be the best versions of ourselves. There's no magic pill for becoming a great man. No shortcuts, no hacks. It's not about quick fixes or overnight success. It's a journey, a climb. Each step you take, each challenge you face, shapes you into who you are meant to be. And trust me, the view from the top, worth every bit of sweat and struggle. The sense of accomplishment is unparalleled. We see it all the time, this idea that success should be instant. Social media often paints a misleading picture, but real growth? That takes guts. It takes dedication and a relentless spirit. It takes grinding it out when you'd rather hit snooze. It's about those early mornings and late nights. It's about embracing the challenge, knowing that every obstacle you overcome makes you stronger. Each hurdle is a lesson. This isn't about being perfect. Perfection is a myth. It's about being better today than you were yesterday. Progress, no matter how small, is still progress. It's about looking in the mirror and knowing you gave it your all. That's where true satisfaction lies. That's the heart of a man right there. The courage to keep going, the strength to keep pushing. So. If you're looking for easy, turn back now. This path isn't for the faint-hearted. But if you're ready to build yourself into something extraordinary, something you can be proud of, saddle up, prepare for the journey of a lifetime. It's going to be one hell of a ride. Embrace it, and you'll find that the journey itself is the reward. We live in a world obsessed with hacks and overnight successes. Scroll through social media and you're bombarded with images of people seemingly living the dream. But here's the truth. Easy is a lie. Deep down, we crave the struggle. We yearn for the satisfaction of earning our stripes. It's in our DNA, this primal urge to overcome, to conquer. Think about it. What's more rewarding, acing a test you barely studied for or crushing one you poured your heart and soul into? Exactly. The struggle, the effort, that's where the real satisfaction lies. So don't shy away from the hard stuff. Lean into it. Embrace the grind. Because that's where you'll find not just success, but true fulfillment. Listen up, gentlemen. This journey we're on, it's yours. Own it. Every triumph, every setback, every lesson learned along the way, it's all part of shaping you into the man you're meant to be. And here's the thing, you're not alone in this. Every man, from the titans of industry to the everyday heroes walking among us, has faced their own trials. We all stumble, we all fall. It's what you do after that defines you. 
Don't be afraid to reach out to connect with other men who are on this path. Share your struggles, your victories, learn from one another. Iron sharpens iron, right? Remember, this journey is uniquely yours, but you don't have to walk it alone. We're all in this together. Let's talk about failure. It's a word that makes people cringe, but here's the truth. Failure is not the opposite of success. It's a stepping stone. Think about any successful person you admire. I guarantee you they faced their fair share of setbacks. The difference? They didn't let those failures define them. They learned from them. They adapted. They evolved. They came back stronger. Look, life is going to throw you curveballs. You're going to get knocked down. The key is to get back up, dust yourself off, and figure out what went wrong. Embrace failure as a chance to learn, to grow, to become more resilient. Because the only true failure is giving up. Section 5. The Blueprint of Success. Planning Your Rise. We all want to achieve great things, right? But here's the deal. You can't just wish your way to success. You need a plan. Think of it like building a house. You wouldn't just start laying bricks without a blueprint, would you? The same goes for your life. What are your goals? What steps do you need to take to achieve them? Break it down. Create a roadmap. And then, most importantly, take action. Having a plan gives you direction, focus, and purpose. Without it, you're just drifting, hoping for the best. And hope, my friends, is not a strategy. Section 6. Embrace the grind effort equals results. Let's be real, nothing worthwhile comes easy. If you want something bad enough, you have to be willing to work for it. You have to embrace the grind. This isn't about glorifying the hustle culture or working yourself to the bone. It's about understanding that effort equals results. The more you put in, the more you get out. It's that simple. Think of it like working out. You don't get ripped by hitting the gym once a month. It takes consistency, dedication, and pushing yourself beyond your comfort zone. The same goes for anything you want to achieve in life. Embrace the grind, gentlemen. It's where greatness is forged. Hello, everyone. Life is very short, but if we had great information that would help us navigate through this life in a much faster, much better way, that would be a great thing. And I have four books that I believe will help young men become great men. So look it up. Don't hesitate. Just look at the books, see if they have information in there, that will help you become a great man. It will help your son, mothers and fathers, for him to become a great man. Life's too short. And if you get information fast enough, you can enjoy life much better. My books will help you do that. I believe. Section 7. Consistency is king showing up every day. We've all heard the saying, consistency is key. But let me tell you, it's more than just a catchy phrase. It's the bedrock of success, the secret sauce, the whole damn enchilada. You see, it's not about being perfect every single day. It's about showing up even when you don't feel like it. It's about chipping away at your goals one small step at a time. Think of it like building a muscle. You don't get jacked overnight. It takes consistent effort over time. The same goes for your dreams, your ambitions, your goals. So make a commitment to yourself to show up every day, even if it's just for 15 minutes. Trust me, those small, consistent actions will compound over time and lead to extraordinary results. Section 8. The Power Within. You are your biggest asset. This is a reminder that everything you need to succeed is already within you. Gentlemen, let's talk about the most powerful tool you possess. Your mind. It's the engine that drives your actions, the compass that guides your decisions. It can be your greatest ally or your worst enemy. The choice is yours. Your mindset shapes your reality and it can either propel you forward or hold you back. You see, everything starts with belief. Belief is the foundation upon which all success is built. If you don't believe in yourself, in your abilities, in your vision, then who will? Self-belief is the first step towards achieving anything worthwhile. Doubt is a poison that will cripple you before you even start. It sows seeds of fear and hesitation. But here's the good news. Belief is a muscle. Just like any other muscle, it can be trained and strengthened. You can strengthen it with every challenge you overcome, every goal you achieve, and every obstacle you conquer. Every time you push past your comfort zone, each step forward builds your confidence and reinforces your belief in yourself. So, cultivate that belief in yourself. Nurture it daily with practices that reinforce your self-worth. Feed it with positive affirmations, words that uplift and empower you. 
Surround yourself with supportive people, those who encourage and inspire you to be your best self and celebrate your wins no matter how small. Each victory is a testament to your strength and resilience. Remember, you are capable of amazing things. Your potential is limitless. You just have to believe it first. Embrace your power, trust in your journey, and watch as you achieve greatness. Section 9. Silence the inner critic. Doubt kills more dreams than failure ever will. We all have that voice in our heads, the one that whispers doubts and insecurities. It's time to silence that inner critic, gentlemen. It's holding you back from achieving your full potential. Think about it. How many times have you talked yourself out of something before you even started because of that voice? How many opportunities have you missed because you doubted your abilities? Here's the thing. Doubt is a liar. It feeds on your fears and insecurities, distorting your perception of reality. So, the next time that voice starts whispering negativity, crank up the volume on your inner champion. Remind yourself of your past victories, your strengths, your resilience. You are capable of amazing things. Don't let doubt steal your dreams. Section 10. Seizing your potential. The choice is yours. We all have potential, gentlemen. It's inside each and every one of us waiting to be unleashed. But here's the catch. Potential unrealized is just wasted energy. It's like having a Ferrari parked in the garage collecting dust. The choice is yours. Will you settle for mediocrity or will you step into your greatness? Will you let fear and doubt hold you captive or will you break free and chase your dreams? The path to greatness isn't always easy. It will test you, challenge you, push you to your limits, but I promise you it's worth it. So what are you waiting for? Embrace the unknown. Take that leap of faith. The world is waiting for you to unleash your full potential. Section 11. Forge your legacy. Leave your mark on the world. At the end of the day, gentlemen, it's not just about what you achieve in life, but about the legacy you leave behind. It's about the footprints you leave on the sands of time, the echoes of your actions that resonate long after you're gone. What mark will you make on the world? Will it be one of kindness, innovation, or perhaps a blend of both? Think about the people you admire, the ones who inspire you. They weren't just successful, they were significant. What is it about them that resonates with you? Their accomplishments, their character, their unwavering commitment to their values, the impact they've had on others, their ability to touch lives, to make a difference, to be remembered for their contributions. Your legacy is not something you build overnight. It's a continuous journey, a series of deliberate actions and choices. It's built brick by brick, day by day, through your actions, your words, and the way you choose to live your life. Every decision, every effort, every moment counts. So ask yourself, what do you want to be remembered for? What stories do you want people to tell about you? What impact do you want to have on the world? How will you contribute to the greater good, to the progress of humanity? And then go out there and make it happen. Leave your mark, gentlemen. Be the change you wish to see. The world is waiting for your story. It's a blank canvas ready for you to paint your masterpiece. Ladies, I want you to help me create a world of great men by my book and give it to your man. He will thank you, and your son will thank you too. Hello again. Thanks for watching the video. I'll see you on the next one. The man takes dedication. More than a man is an endless job. Go for humanity, y'all deserve some props. Everybody knows the sound is clear. Everybody knows they hear the truth. Everybody knows the sound is clear. Everybody knows they hear the truth. More than a man, add some civility. More than a man, build your integrity. More than a man, brings dependability to family and his world.